against Nana. I skin you alive. I skin you alive. Look at you. But Papa, it's not fair at all, oh. Every time me and I come out, we did everything in this house. Why Nana does nothing but, but eat and play? <laughs> Anything as if I'm the only person that is suffering from Nana's laziness in this house. What am I supposed to say? Eh? You keep complaining about the same thing and you keep getting punished without any results. Oh, you want me to partake in your punishment? Ha. <laughs> Lazy boy. Go to the market and join Mama. Soon I will be hungry. Nana, I'll slap you in this house. I'll slap you. I need a place to Do a slap him. Come and slap him. Achi o bunachi aba. Awo achi mbogoro. Achi o bunachi aba. Awo achi mbogoro. Come and slap him. I will deal with you. Achi o bunachi aba. Awo achi mbogoro. What are you both doing here? Choma, am I not talking to somebody? What are you doing here? Mama, I've been thinking of... Thinking about what? I've been thinking about that young mad woman that we saw on our way to the market. Yeah, what about that? I am yet to understand why women go mad when they cheat on their husband. But men do. And they go scot free. Mama, it's not just that. This issue of women marginalization in this village is getting too much. We do virtually everything, like the men, and yet we are denied chances of furthering our education. My daughters, there is more to this than meets the eye. Women marginalization in this our community is a thing that no one knows how to handle. <sighs> Mama, it's not fair at all. It's not fair. In as much as I don't support marital infidelity, but the men should also run mad when they cheat on their wives. Yes. Oh, it's possible that the man might have forced the woman into committing adultery because of his compulsive infidelity. Now the woman is roaming the streets mad, yet the same equally unfaithful husband is there enjoying himself with other women without any punishment, nothing. It's not fair. I even heard I feel in this our community that this nonsense tradition still exists. Oh. That is why I've maintained I will never marry from this village. I cannot just tolerate the injustice meted on women in this village. I cannot just take it. My daughters, women marginalization is everywhere. Though it seems to be more deep rooted in our community. But that is not enough reason for you to say that you will not marry from my community. If a responsible man comes knocking on our door, hmm? please go to the kitchen, finish what you're doing. Your father will soon start asking for food. Go and start what you're supposed to do. Please go, it is getting dark. Women marginalization. That should be disturbing you. It's one one now. We live in a world of pain and sorrow. See beautify beauty. He who misses me misses a treasure. Because I am one of a kind. Beautify beauty. <laughs> Miss Obiagu. Miss Abapandike. Of course. First runner up, Miss Emene. <laughs> Please, hand of applause for me. <laughs> yes, I am beautiful. I am very pretty. <laughs> uh. 
Two times. What is it? What has so deeply engrossed you? Don't tell me that that beautiful young girl is the mother of those little kids. Is that why you are standing there like a statue and moping? Yes. Let's go, John. Come, let's go. Are you trying to tell me it's a common and normal thing for beautiful young girls like this to have kids outside marriage? No, most of them are married. Though we have a few single mothers among them. Mary, at this age, what happens to their education? <sighs> education. It's like a tradition in my village that girls only finish a primary education. Only very few of them go beyond secondary school. Just a negligible few enlightened ones among them allow their children to go to the university. I am happy that, boy, that my father happens to be among those enlightened ones. That is awful. Why are they destroying the future of these young girls? Baba, please, please. We met this thing this way and there is nothing we can do about it. Please, I don't want us to discuss this issue now. Please, I disagree with you. I really disagree with you. You might have met it this way. That don't mean it should remain the same way. Dabo. The cavemen did not wear clothes then, but your people are wearing clothes today. Dabo. If you want to go naked, go naked. If you want to put, put air in, put air, if you want to... So why don't your people Dabo. go naked? Because the cavemen were naked. Dabo. If you want to go naked, you can go naked. If you want to wear anything, if you want to put on wig on your hair, put on wig. Because the cavemen are... are, are Just are tell naked. me that your people do not want to put a stop to this one. That boy, whatever you want, that boy, please, can you go naked for me? Can you go can you go naked for me? Your people are mad. My people are mad. Yes. And and they are following me. Yeah? They are following the mad person. This is the mad person. Papa. I, I, I don't want to go back to that house. I don't want to go back to that family. Papa, you forced me to marry Ken at the age of 16. I did. And now that he's dead, you want me to marry his elder brother who already has two wives, Papa? I can't do that. I, I, I can't. I... You must go back to that family and become your first wife, as the tradition demands. That was how I married your mother when her husband, my brother, died. If I didn't marry her, would you have come into this world to Tuaromoka? No, but that was then. That was then. This is now. I, I just thank God I, I did not have any child for him. If not, they would have used that in owing me down now. They would have used it in tying me down. Papa Emeka, I think you should reconsider your stance on that issue. Hmm? How do you expect her to become a third wife at this age? Ask him. Mbano. <laughs> Just let her be, please. I mean, what are you even saying? Are you out of your mind? How old were you when I could you like Eh? When I married and colonized you, were you not younger than her? You want me to be taking care of somebody who ordinarily should be taking care of me? It will not happen. She will either go back to that her husband's house or she will leave the house. That's all. Look at your It's okay, hmm? Ada. Stop crying. Oh? Stop. It's okay. Hmm? He will soon come back to his senses. Oh? Mama, I beg you. I, I beg you. <laughs> I don't want to go back to that house. I, 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 I don't want to go back to that house. I, I want to continue with my education, Mama. I want to continue with my education. Uh, 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 Ada, Ada, Ada. <laughs> I am sure you are not going back to that mass house. <laughs> yeah, but what I cannot promise you now is continuing your education. Huh? It's okay. I'm just praying for another man to come and marry you. <laughs> It's okay. It's okay. See, when 
<laughs> when another man marries you, he will send you to school if he wants. <laughs> oh, it's okay. <laughs> uh, it's okay. <laughs> Nana! Nana! Papa! Come! Yes, sir. Sit down. Good. Take this money. Go and buy jam form. Hmm? When the time for the examination reaches, I'm going to arrange some teachers to help you in the examination hall. Yes, Papa. Yes, Papa. Thank you very much, Papa. soon I will become a lioness. <laughs> Lala, you won't kill me in this house. Do you know the meaning of what you just said? Eh? Do you know what lioness means? Lioness is a female lion. Mm -hmm. ah. mm. Whatever. All I know is that I will be a University of Nigerian graduate soon. <laughs> I'm off to jump office. Mama, Papa has started again, no? Is it that he gives us our own money or I will cause a scene in this family? Yes, Mama. Papa has to give us our own money. I have seen Nana that just finished writing his secondary school exams. He hasn't even seen his O level results. Papa has given him money to buy jam form. And yet the same Papa has been telling me for the past three years that he doesn't have money. Mama, this is not fair at all. Papa will tell us today whether we are his children or not. Yes. Why are people making noise here as if you have suddenly become market women? Papa eh? Choma. Who you Who for you got Choma? Eh? Papa Choma, so many things are going wrong in this house. Eh. Why would you give Nana money to go and buy jam from? While his sisters, who have left school all these years, have not written the exam. Is it fair? Mm. Is that why they are twisting their faces, their wrinkled faces, as if they have got a million more? Eh? Who back up with your neighbor? Who are you back on our babu? Who are you back on our babu? Who back up with your babu? All these years, you have been telling me you don't have money, you don't have money. Now that money has grown wings and flown into your pocket. You would have started buying phones for all of them. Yes. Ah, chop yes. your mouth. Neka Hadecha. You expect me to use my hard-earned money to train girls in the university. They are your children and not girls. It is their right and not privilege. And if anybody should go into the university, that should be trauma first. Mm. Who have left school all these years? Mm. Nah, you... And I've told you I will not do it. I will use my money to train girls in the university. Only for men to come and pick them and put in their kitchens as cooks. Oh, my man, I won't do it. Okay. So this is why you left these children all this while and telling me that you don't have money. Now it's unfair. These are your children. You must treat them equally. Nana, what are you still doing here? What are you still doing here? Will you go and buy the farm before it is too late? Baba, this is not fair. This is not fair. You buy our jam from for us today, or else there will be no peace in this Come house again. There will be no peace. Come on, it's not time me. we put an end to this. So why would you bring us into this world in the first place? Why well, you know you will not take care of us very well? <laughs> eh? Mommy, I'm not picking again. Just like your mother. <laughs> 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 
Okay, then go see. Papa Mecca, what is it? No, they are just practicing how to cry. Mama. Go see. Okay, then. Adobe, what is it? Papa wants me to go back to Kenna's place, but I, 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 I don't want you, Mama. Please, please help me, beg him. I, 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 I don't want to go back to Kenna's place. You're not going anywhere. You're not going anywhere. Huh? Papa Mecca, I thought we had sorted everything out now. Eh? You, you are who sorted what out? Why did you sort what sort it out? She's not going anywhere. She's not going anywhere. Yes. After she's still young and beautiful, another man will come and marry her. Well, I've made my point clear. She's not entering this house again. I am the owner of this house. My decision, whatever I say, is final. I'm the head of this family. Anybody who doesn't like my decision can pack and go. Even this one's. Ola. This thing. Pack. Go. That's all. Okay. Okay. Can I still enter the house? If you like now. If yeah. you like. <laughs> Papa, uh, uh, Papa, because I know you're not being fair to me. Oh. You're, you're not being fair to me, Papa. You're not being fair. I can talk to two of you. It's a good here. Yeah. Okay. Hey. What's the meaning? Why are you bringing, meaning of this? Why are you bringing that matter? Since you don't want my daughter to stay, yeah. you two should leave. Eh? Mm. Hey! Abomination! Igwe must hear this. Igwe must. Igwe. Okay, don't worry. Anyway. Don't worry. But at least I can enter my house now. Which house? Eh? Which house? Open okay, make a which house? Wait, you got one. You're not entering again. You're not again, eh? Yes. You're not again. Okay, what? He wants to fight me. Oh. Come on. Oh, yeah. Come on. Yeah. Let's fight. What is this? Oh, you want to fight me? Yes. Hey. Fight. What is this? Heavenly. What is this? Heavenly, I receive this eh? now. Eh? I'll what kill can someone. You I'll kill someone. You will just kill yourself. Eh? You cannot do anything. Eh? You will just kill yourself. Eh? 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 Hey, 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 hold me now, Tiger. Respect you want yourself. to fight? Respect yourself. Respect Come and hold me. Respect yourself. Yeah. 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 Papa, hey, hey, you are. What's going on? What? 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 It's okay. It's okay. Come, come. Get up. Get up. Get up. Get up. Get up. It's okay. 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 Come, come, come. I intend to take. Adobe with me when I return to the city. And I also intend to enroll her in the university. And then subsequently, I want to station her by. Um, Wambiko, eh? Sorry to interrupt you. Oh? There is no problem if you want to take your sister to the city. But training her in the university is not acceptable, Biko. Why do you want to do this to me now? Don't you want me to enjoy like my fellow women? You don't want me to go for Mugo? Huh? Well, you're very funny. Uh, I have no problem with you uh, going for Mugo. Mama, you will go for Mugo. I promise you. You will. My sister Adobe will equally get married. But with education, Mama, with good education, Adobe will be able to marry into a good family with a reputable background. And not all these literates in this village. Uh, Mekam, Mom, I thought you said your business is just picking up. Why do you have to waste money training her in the university again? Uh, Papa, with due respect, training my sister in the university is not a waste of money. It is not. In fact, that is the best thing I can do for her right now. Yes. Um, my business 
was previously unstable. And that was the reason, sincerely, I did not come home. But now, it is more stable. And so I intend to face my responsibilities squarely. Okay. Uh, in that case, you can go with all of them. Uh, as long as you don't ask me for one naira. What is wrong with you? How can you agree to that kind of arrangement? Do you know how long it will take? That is what you have always wanted. Eh? Sir, you can do whatever you like. Eh? But when you go to city, don't forget to buy me my motorcycle. And again, bring back the dowry. So that if our in-laws come, I can give them their money. I don't blame you. Papa Meka, I don't blame you. If you want to take your sister to the city, go ahead. But training her in the university, mba. Even this one too, you will not train her. If it is so binna, go ahead. You want to take him to Cambridge. Ngiwama. But these ones, mm -mm. If I had gone to the university, would any of you have seen the air today? Eh? Mama, times have changed. There is nothing as constant as change. The days you were you are talking about now, they are totally different from what we have now. Mama, ask yourself, what if Uncle Joe had not picked me up and trained me in the university. Mama, where would I be today? Mama, I want me to go to school. I promise I, I, I won't disappoint you. I won't. Mama. Mama. Provide my, my job from now. Or the entire village will hear from us. <coughs> mm -hmm. I'm talking to you. Nana! Nana, hit me! I'll, I'll, I'll kill you! Hey, no. because, I, because I don't, I don't kill you! Yes. No, no. Eh? And you! Papa! Papa! What is it? Why do you want to kill my own son for me? My only son? Choma and Amaka? You did not even want to ask what the problem is. You started taking sides already. 
The sooner you stop it, the better for all of us in this family. It is happening. Why is everybody fighting? Chukoka, ask your bully cousins. They want to kill my only son for me. My only son. Brother, don't mind Papa. Papa has been treating us like slaves in this family. Mm -hmm. Now, calm down. Can somebody tell me what is wrong? Mama, can you please tell me what is happening here? You are embarrassing me before my friend. Chuka, my son, I am sorry. Please. Um, we are just coming in. We don't know the cause of the squabble. We met them fighting. Please. Oh, 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 see, the one that hit my, my jump bed form. And uh, if you do not bring it here, uh, uh, this side will not stop. Oh. They did what? Papa? They hit the form I bought for you with my money? Yes, Papa. Where's the form? Chuka! Trauma and Amaka, are you with the jump form? Brother, Papa said that training us in school is a waste of money. But he wants to waste his money on this big head here. Where? See, brother, eh? It is either Papa trains all of us in school or nobody at all, no? We are sick and tired of Papa's unparalleled um, injustice and marginalization in this family. Where is the form? Where is the form? The form? Form? Uncle. Where is it? Uncle. Uncle, please. please. Uncle, please. I said I am going to take care of the situation. Now, Chioma and Amaka, if you are in possession of that form, please go and bring it. I am going to buy your own forms for you. Toka, yeah? I am going to disappoint you. Before your friend, I swear. Where is the form? Okay. Where is it from? Please leave them now. Listen okay. to Chuka. I am bought okay. it with my money. Okay. Where is it from? Take, take it. Chuka, I'm not joking here. Please take it. Easy. I'm going to disappoint you. Chuka, now listen to him. Get away. Get away. Where is it from? Uncle, please. please. Okay. Look, no, no, no. I'll, I'll come back to the visit. I'll come back. Look at people here. Look at this. 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 Brother Chooks, I'm sick and tired of life in this village. Papa is making life miserable for Amaka and I. I understand how you feel. But you need to exercise special for him. I am sure that he will change his perception of many things with time. Please. Brother, whether he changes his perception or not, I don't care. I'm no longer interested. I don't even want to go to school again. Right now, all I need is a man of my choice. I will just marry him, settle down and leave Papa's miserable house for him. You don't have to give up on your dreams. You need a first degree at the university first. Besides, Chooks has promised to help you with the university. Thank you, I appreciate your concern. But the pain is just too much for me. I can't bear it anymore. The only option I have right now is marriage. Choma, please don't do that. All I need from you, sit for the exams, pass it, and then leave the rest for me. Please, listen to your brother. You know he will not deceive you. Something wrong with you? Are you crazy? Are you like astral traveling or, 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 or spirit or something? Cars can hurt you? You want me to commit murder? Listen, if you have a problem, you should stay at home and think about it. And don't present problems for unsuspecting motorists. You're still there? Get out of there! Get out now! Sorry to say this, but I must confess your people are still living in the days of lack of civilization. That drama I witnessed at your uncle's house, that will not leave my mind in a very long time. I so you sir, my brother. Some ancient good-for-nothing customs and traditions are still being practiced 
in my village and one of the funniest of them all is that if a man's wife mistakenly or intentionally cheats on the husband she runs mad mad that is not so bad what about the men what happens if they do cheat oh, nothing is only applicable to the female but there's a severe punishment for any man that sleeps with another man's wife Okay. Hmm. These ones are good. At least, it helps prevent my, all this marital infidelity. Unlike those other barbaric ones that just chase their girls into marriage area, early and stuff. I thank God, though, my parents are not like that. I can't imagine my sisters going through these pains and troubles my cousins are going through right now. I can't. That is really sad. You need to help those girls. Those girls are too beautiful and intelligent to be going through all this. Looking at Choma, I could tell she meant every single word she was saying. She does. She does. But anyway, I think I'll, I'll try my best to help them. I'll try my best. Huh? My brother, eat food. You say you don't want to take any alcohol? No, I'm okay with the water. My brother, look at, look at the culture. Adobe, it's okay. It's okay. Stop crying. Stop. I already spoke with Mama. And she has promised to be calm. Please. But I don't want to stay here anymore. I, I don't want to stay here. I don't want to. See, immediately you leave, they will become more troublesome. Mama, especially, I know how to. Stop shouting. Stop shouting. You, you want to cause a scene? Calm down. Listen, I also had a word with Papa, and he promised me that he would not force you to go back to Kenna's family house. Okay? So since he has said that, what else do you want? I'll come back and pick you and take you to the city with me. There's no problem. Hey brother, Mama's case could be worse at times. She's too stubborn for my liking. Especially with this issue of Omogo, she can be very, very unyielding. I know. She's our mother, I know her very well. Okay? But this time around, they have promised me that they will wait. Okay? I'll make arrangements for the dowry. I'll give them back the money. And then I will come and take you with me to the city. See, you know what? I'll send you a phone. Hmm? The two I brought with me, I already gave it to them. Like a subtle bribe. Hmm? That will keep them calm for now. Come here. <laughs> it's okay now. Can't I tell you that thing? I'll get angry. It's okay. Yeah? Alright? Shh, it's okay. Come here, let me talk to them. Alright? Hey, me, Wam. No, no, sit down, eh? Sit down, my son. You're welcome. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Papa? Yeah. Mama? Yeah. Um, I am ready to go. Uh, Papa, yeah. like we said, please, no more quarreling. Please. Yeah. No problem. It's your mother should be talking to. You know me uh -huh. and your father. I can't hurt a fly. Now I'm taking a decision to be looking like dog. Yeah, Papa, Mecca. Papa, don't just mention my name, oh. Huh? As if you're not waiting for him to leave before you start your troubles. Abokama also. Mama, please. Please. Inland sample. Papa. That's why I said enough of this quarreling and arguing and embarrassment. Is it not him? I, I know. Eh? Okay, sorry. I'm if, just keeping quiet because of I you. I know. If, Mama, please. Please. If there's any problem, hmm? flash me. I'll call you if you need anything. No problem. Huh? Uh, Please. The only thing you have to do for me, don't stay long before you come back again. Make sure you come home regularly. I, I will. Uh, so that uh, any time I see you now, I'll become very happy before this woman kills me. Oh! Emeka, I'm just Ma. taking this thing because of you. Ma, Ma, thank you. Ma. 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 Ma.
Oh, 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 no problem. Please, yeah. eh? if if there's anything you need, let me know. And then that thing you ask me, <laughs> I will I will arrange it. Because thank you. <laughs> okay, okay. Mama. Mama. You just want my own. Yeah, lovely. Oh. Papa. Take it easy, Mama. 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 Bye bye. You and who? Here. Yeah. I thought this thing had been sorted out. We have settled. You and who? Come and eat me now. Come and eat me. Problems with my family right now. I've been rejecting all the girls that they bring to me you know, for marriage, and now they're insisting I should bring one of my own before I can return to the city, you know, since I'm rejecting their offer. No, nah. That is wrong, bro. These people are not trying at all, though. Ah, this is marriage you are talking about, and they should allow you to make your own choice. I'm, I'm glad someone knows, but they don't understand. They think the best thing for me is to be tied down by a woman. And you know the worst part of the whole thing? They want me to marry someone from, from this village. Hmm? Ah. That one is good though. I'm telling you, that one is good. At least you, you, you are sure your wife will not be messing around with men even when she has caught with another woman. Because I'm sure you're not going to be a faithful husband. I don't know possible. Wait, 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 tradition of you know women running mad when they cheat on their husbands is still holds in this village yeah 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 it's still very effective in fact some girls ran mad recently as a result of that so now why me want to marry this village i want to marry from this village i can't stand on that man sleeping with my wife I, I, I it's unimaginable I, I, oh, I can't imagine that i can't imagine in fact i will kill my wife if she cheats on me i don't care if she runs mad or not i will kill her you i will kill her myself commit murder in that case, get ready not to cheat because you cheat, she cheats. It's a two-way thing. You cheat, she cheats. Cheat, she cheats. You need to talk and from out. Bros, I sincerely advise you to pick a girl from this village. I know why. How can I do that? The girls I see in this village are too timid for my liking. I know the worst part of the whole thing is that my parents want me to get married before I can leave for the city. I mean, I'm in a big mess. I could lose my job. Wait, wait, wait. I know someone you like. Choma, daughter of Mazim, you will surely like this girl. You will like her, you will like this girl. And, you know, you think she measures up to my standards? The problem is not whether she measures up to her standard. The problem is whether she will accept you. This is the hottest girl in this community. I know they had her to issue red cards anyhow to boys. Yeah, well, She's very, gonna, very selective. Come on, that's not going to happen to me. You're supposed to know where I'd be now. Listen, how do we see this damsel of yours? Um, I think we may need to go to the house and hang around. If she comes out, we'll see her. But if she doesn't, we dare not step into the house. The father is a no-nonsense man, at least not without a plausible reason. Oh, come on. He's not going to do anything to me. I mean, considering the, family, the family I come Make from, you know? <laughs> Every time you go to the boost, 
no be that kind man no if they go there not with me as per what now she now she now Right, whatever, mm -hmm. but, but when are we going to see this damsel of yours? Like that? Mm, not today, not today. Maybe we need to prepare. You have to prepare yourself. Oh. This girl, no, be anyhow, girl. Oh. Yeah, whatever. Let's just see the girl you're talking about. Not today, not today. We live in a world of pain and sorrow. We live in a life of fear and of shadows. We pay in a price of the things we don't know about. We dying in pain and we're looking for a way out. <sighs> My eyes pain me. From <laughs> Go away, so joy will fill our hearts. Hoping for a better day tomorrow. <laughs> My love, I wish this honeymoon would continue. <laughs> I give God all the praises and glory for bringing you my way. I promise to love you to the end of time. Nothing, nothing will ever come in between us. Nothing, nothing will ever come between us. Because you've already made me understand the real meaning of love. Thank you very much. <laughs> oh. I wonder what life would have been without you. Words can't really express how much I love you. I pledge my love to you. Honestly, I pledge my love to you. And I promise to give you as many children as you desire. Thank you. This is my solemn promise. Thank you. <laughs> you, love me. you know what? I love you so much, Ifi. I love you. Shh. Come here. I love you too. <laughs> oh. And I love you more. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. Oh, we have to go now. <laughs> Honestly, Esther, I do not understand this game you're playing with me. For how long shall we continue to sit here, waiting for something I do not understand? Just be a little more patient. I'm quite sure they will soon be out. Relax. Listen to me. Is that my husband you see around here with another woman? Chidi cannot and never cheat on me. So I advise you quit playing games with my heart. You know how emotional I am. Moi. Playing games with your heart? If my aunt, listen, let me tell you. Have I ever lied to you? Have I? I did not want to tell you this, but it's just that things are getting out of. Is that not Chidi? Coming out from that building? No, maybe it's not him. That's his photocopy. Am I still a liar?
that you've seen things yourself. Thomas. Hey! Honey, I don't understand what you're talking about. I mean, I can say it over and over and over and over again. You don't know who you saw. Me, Chidi, in a hotel with another woman. Never. Why are you still lying? Even when I caught you red-handed. Chidi. Chidi. I can't believe this is you. Please. I didn't get married to you just because I wanted to get married. But I got married to you because I loved you. And I still love you. Why can't you just open up and tell me the truth? You know I will always have a place in my heart to forgive you. And stop lying. I beg of you. Ify. You are still accusing me wrongly. Honestly, you're getting on my nerves. And I don't like it. Ify, you're pissing me off. What is the meaning of this? Were you dreaming? Cut me right handed. Where? Enough. No. You lie. You lie. Just tell me why you did it. No. Enough. If you don't call me a liar again, I will call you as many times as I want because that's who you are. You that's, what you are. that's what you are. That's what you are. How dare you? It's me, it's me cheating.
You don't ask me that kind of question. Me and you, they come, they ask me whether she's there. I go know whether she's around or not. We will just have to hang around here. If she comes out, you see her. If she doesn't come, they will come, come back. Come on, that's a long process now. Why don't we just go in there and see the parents or whoever we have to see? Please, please, if they go, go. I know they go with you. You know the kind of family I come from. They'll be happy to see me there. I have told you, you know, be everywhere you go, they pass Maga. The, the girl's father no nonsense person, so I know if he go there, I know how many person use cause last chase me. Just hold on, the girl will come out, I know. Just... Yeah, that's the brother. See, the guy no great problem. If you come, just give him something. You will come out for us now, now, now. Hello, Anna. Hello. Come on. Uh, I'm looking for my sister. <laughs> I think you know <laughs> The elder one knows this one. Yeah. Is she around? I'm not sure if she's around. No. Okay. <laughs> uh, gang, gang, come up for us, okay? Uh, We're waiting. Let me call her, she's around. Uh, <laughs> the guy, this guy don't give a problem. Don't be waiting, person, they think, they think. That's the cap. Yeah, they actually a different thing. So we're just gonna wait for them here? No. We're not gonna wait here. Enter now. Make the father use use cutlass, cut your leg. And so you will limp come out. Oh, come on. Ah. What's so difficult about doing it then? I want to do it. Yeah, don't go. My sister said that she doesn't want to see anybody. But I, I need to see her. I need to know what she looks like. See her. He's interested in your sister. He wants to marry your sister. Ah, okay. And you know your sister is very beautiful, so he needs to see her and confirm that she's beautiful. Do you have like like uh, her picture on your phone? I don't have phone, no. I beg you, if you give us her picture, just go, go, go. Eh, we'll go find it something. Just go, go, go. I want him to see your sister. I mean, you don't want to have him as an in-law. Special. Mm -hmm. If you see this girl, you go mail her. What's so fantastic about this girl? You keep praising her. And I tell you, if you see this girl, all those close where they promise me, you'll bring her to Lesbeth. Lesbeth, yes, girl. Bam, that's the Asama Lover. Oh, boom. This is the girl I told you now, the one I almost hit with my car, that I was shouting at. This is the girl. It's not at, at, at my sister. She go, was, go, she go, was go. blocking the road and I almost hit her. Go, go, but go, you, go. You, you said you want to marry her. You shut her at her. Now, tomorrow, if you marry her, you'll be punching her. Punching at her, beating her. I have to, I've always told you to. What do you expect me to do? She, she was blocking her. the road. And so? And and so I, I almost killed her. I trust you. I know you must have run your mouth on the really. Come here, they go. Do you think she'll be angry? I just, you know what? If you see her next time, behave. Act very responsibly. You know, be this thing where they do. They could have told you. Don't lie yourself. Humble yourself. This place is not the town. She'll be angry. You don't begin to ask that kind of question again. I go know that she will be angry. If now you know be angry. Come with the the father can't see us here. I have serious plans to leave this village. And if you be any time so any two way won't make you go I'm now. Bon, bon. What's up? Mm. No, excuse me. Let me attend to my friend. Okay. I'll see some other time. Okay, bye. Yeah. I got to your friend. Yeah, bye. Uh, whatever. Mm. Who's that? You like this one? You don't say I'm not. You like her? Are you stupid? I'm <laughs> sorry. Well, why keep it like this? What's up? Man, I talked with the girl. I'm just coming from speaking. So, what's up now? She comply? Comply? <laughs> she didn't even let me finish talking with her. And she said no. Just like that? Anyway, I wasn't expecting it to be that easy because I know of about five men that have been on her neck for the same married thing. I, no, I, 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 I didn't know that girl was so beautiful. I mean, she's beautiful and she's intelligent. You know, I, I shouldn't have spoken to her the way I did that day. Wait, wait, are you sure if that's not the reason she's doing this? You know? No, 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 she's just being herself. She's just being herself. But uh, you don't have to give up so easily. She may still come around, you know now. They are no massacre now. Well, like giving up is not in my dictionary. <laughs> it's not, it's not in my dictionary. Yeah. So, listen. I think we should go somewhere, have a few drinks and then plan a strategy. Are you serious? I hope you are loaded because I need that more. Now the thing comes now, man. Yeah, I'm always loaded, man. Okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm always loaded. loaded. You know what? Why? I have another idea. This one will surely work. Trust me. Just boost me well. well. Yeah, yeah, I trust you. I trust you. My dear, pressure is really on me to get married. 
I don't think my parents can tolerate me anymore if I don't comply. Mm -hmm. So you don't want to further your education again? That is how it seems. I don't even know what to do again. I'm even tired of staying in our house. My parents are making the house a hell for me. I just pray God will send me a man that will send me to school as his wife. Oh Diego, you better delete that from your mind because no man from this village will do so. Unless you are getting married to someone outside this village. God will grant my noble heart desire. I pray so. Easy now. I all hope it's not entirely lost. You, you don't seem to understand what is going on here. My parents are on my neck to get married. Now I found this girl and I have feelings for her. I think she's good for me. But the thing is, I have to finish everything before my leave ends. And my dad says I'm not going anywhere until I commit to someone. Ah, that is wrong. That is very, very wrong. This is marriage we are talking about for better for worse. So I don't think they should be rushing you. They should give it some more time. You don't understand. They, they've given me enough time, but I did not utilize it. And now they are afraid that, you know, I, I'll get a girl in the city pregnant and then impose her on <laughs> them as a daughter-in-law. That one, uh, <laughs> the message is for our wordness. But all the same, yeah, like I told you before, I have a suggestion. Why don't you tell your parents to use their influence on her family? Let them meet her family on your behalf. Yes. No, that, 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 that's not going to happen. I mean, they've been bringing girls for me and I've been rejecting them. You know? They said I should go and find my own girl. Why find her now? I will not be find her. Their job is to use their influence on her family because I'm sure every family in this village will want to associate with your family. <laughs> Don't know with you anymore. Come, Bobo. Bobo, mm. are you trying to insult me? No. Now me the body the shark with the shark, so... Sorry, sorry. Before you change your mind now. But that is true, that is true that I tell you now. Do you think it will work? Yeah, it will surely work. I would have almost said you meet her friends by yourself, but I'm afraid you may not know the right words to use while talking to them. Okay, now, if I should subject you to some kind of test, what would you tell them when you get there? Upon saying no, do well the first time we meet again. <laughs> nah, enough for bad for you. You know my problem with you. Mm -hmm. You talk too much. You really talk too much. You bring so many topics into the subject we're talking about. Now, what do I answer? The one about my parents going to 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 talk to the parents, or or me talking to them? All of the above. All of the above because this is marriage we are talking about. So you have to think fast and act smartly. Think, bro. Your leave will soon expire, so you have to think. Yeah, well, I'll just have a few drinks and something will come up. Something. Think, think, bro. Think about But I'll wait the bar now. What? Bring the bar before this guy changes his mind. As you can see, he's having some issues here. So come, we'll bring the bar. I will not, I don't have money to pay if he doesn't pay. So we better bring it now. Yeah. And I must eat this bar today. Think I miss the smoke. Remember. If you smoke past we cross, now cancer of the lungs. Not us, I don't tell you. Take a music. Son, your father and I are very proud of you. Now that you have decided to be a responsible man. Please, do not disappoint us again. Um. Take your job very seriously. Because your father may not support you again if you lose this one carelessly. I know, Mom. I know. I promise I will not disappoint you and dad again. I've learned from my past mistakes and I'll make you very proud of me. I promise. Please do not hesitate to start a wedding preparation when you get back to the city. Yeah, I'll do that. As soon as I get back, I start the preparations and um, I'll keep you posted. Okay. <clears throat> Adobe, you have to choose one of them or you go back to your husband's house. But hello. You think we will allow you to go to the university? It's a woman. Okonkwa's daughter went there. What did she come back with? Pregnancy. After her parents spent a fortune training her. Now I can wait. You have to choose somebody or we choose that person for you. Mama, I don't want to marry any of them. I don't want to marry any of them. You succeeded in forcing me into marrying early. 
I became a widow shortly after that. And now you want to force me again? Never. You people will not succeed this time. Hey! Hey! So, Adobe, you have grown so big to talk back at me. I'm not talking back at you, Mama. I'm only trying to secure my happiness. For Christ's sake, Mother! Would you respect, Mother? Were you forced to marry Papa? Were you? Yes, I was. Why do you think I fight with him always? I never liked him. Oh, yeah? But my parents had the final say. You see? You see, Mama? Oh, so you want me to marry, and then I'll be quarreling with my husband, just like you and Papa? God forbid! I will do no such thing! I will not I quarrel! Shut up! Shut up! Was it not through those quarrels that you, you came into this world? Eh? Listen. You have to make your choice. Choose one of them that you know you will not fight with. Or we will choose your father-like person for you. Mama. I am not marrying. I don't want to marry now. Period. Is it by force? I don't want to marry. Ha! Adobe. If at the end of this week you have not made your choice, we will know if I gave birth to you or the other way around. Come. You're welcome. What a surprise this is. You're welcome, man. We are very disappointed in you. Uh -uh. Your daughter ran back to her house shortly after the husband died. And you never deemed it necessary to take her back to where she belongs. We, are, we will sort out things. I was just trying to meet with my people so that we know what to do. Sorted out in what way? We are not interested in what you think. I've come to take my wife as tradition demands. You only want to cheat me. You want to cheat me? I will not cheat you. Do you understand me? Brother, just give me a little time. This thing will be sorted out. Mazi Ozoko, huh? what are you sorting out? Huh? What are you sorting out? By the way, is your daughter supposed to be here now? A woman who lost her husband? Huh? Have you suddenly forgotten what the tradition demands of a woman who lost her husband? Have you forgotten Mazi Ozoko? Just take it easy now. I will not take what easy. What are what, 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 what am I taking easy? No. You want to cheat me, eh? You want to cheat me? I will not allow that. I will take my wife back to my place today. This thing will end in a very short time. Please give me a little time. It's not as if people think. Oh, I've been telling you this uh, thing. Ozioko, huh? Ozioko, you are my brother. Ozioko, Ozioko. How many times did I call you? We are living with the hope you are going to do the honorable thing. You have seven days. Just seven, seven, seven days. What? Seven days seven is even what? too much. You are giving him seven days. It's even too what? much. Why? I continue waiting. I have until seven days. No! Okonta. No, 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 no. Okonta, it's okay. Uh. It's okay. Let's go. No, it's not a very let's, 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 let's go. Within let's go. Let's month. get out from here. Uh, you be. <laughs> have you seen it? Have you seen it? You have to make a choice between those young men and that old man that already has two wives and numerous children. The choice is your. Mama, get it! Oh, get it! Lafia! Oso Chebu! You're the one influencing her! Eh? If you call me again, I will slap you and you will lose a tooth. I'm not gonna move. of the same feather. You go pink it and watch and guess it. The choice is yours. It's yours. Sister, sister, stop doing this. See, don't mind her. You're not going back to that family. They're not good for you. It is him. It is that, that, that old man. Go. 
sister, understand. God forbid, sister. God forbid, God forbid. Sister, 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 sister. listen to me. If they disturb you again, you go to brother house in the city and stay there. Okay? Here you go. Stop crying here. See, if you are expecting me to go and steal and pay them back their bride price, you must be joking. <coughs> I arrange to bring back their money so that we can fulfill what the custom says. Or Better, you ask your brother to send the money as he promised. Papa, when and how do you expect me to pay back that money? You people better look for a way of settling those people. After all, they gave the money to you now. Did I just hear you say? Eh? Oh, has it come to that in my house? Has it come to that? Um, Papa Emeka, I think we should find a way of settling those people. Because she's not going back to that house. Ma. Who are the way? After all, you were the person that first spent on that money eh, during your August visit. Bam, 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 bam. Papa Mekabiko, don't just go there. Were you not the one that squandered that money on God knows what? Eh? She's not going back there. She has to marry one of th those rich men that are coming for her hand in marriage here. So that we'll use the money they will pay as bride price to settle the other people. Which rich boys are you even talking of when she has not accepted anyone? Yeah. This time around, she does not have a choice. Wow. Yes. She must. Adobe, let me ask you Would you prefer to go back to Okonta's house? Okonta, who is as old as your father? Mm, he's even older, but that's not the issue now. Oh. I'm sure you're not thinking about it. It's better for you to choose from any of these men that are coming for your hand in marriage. So that we will use the money they will pay to settle the other people. <laughs> Mama, the truth is that the two options, they are not even considerable at all. Huh? They are not. You see me, Adobe, I am not going back to Okonta's house, number one. And then number two, I am not ready to marry any man so soon. Biko, please, you should just allow me to recover from Nkemlora Alo. Biko. Have you heard it? No, did you hear that? She's now giving us conditions, telling us what to do and what not to do in my house. Did you hear that? Yeah. Now listen very carefully. I give you only three days to either go back to your husband's house or, hey, the thing that I will do, Maggie, here, here. You will see what I will do. I got here. Adobe, what they can see me be go. You now challenge our authority in this house of where? Mama, I am not challenging your authority. Mama, I'm, I'm only expressing myself. In my house. I will not allow you people to subject me into perpetual agony again. Mama, do you know what I went through in the hands of Ikenna's family before he passed on? Do you? Please, you push just allow me one minute of go in this house. I beg you. Oh, you are not walking out there. You are not you're walking out there. Tell you no. I'm walking in a minute express. No, lum. In my house, you are expressing. Eh? You are expressing in my house. Okay. We will know who owns this house. Have you seen it? It will land them one. Eh? Look at if this one is looking at me. Eh? Now, Jerry, talk, 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 I will not. Okay, try, try what she did now. Try her. Hey, me buga mada here. Me buga mada here. No, 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 Papa. All I'm saying is that something has to be done about it. Period. Listen, there is absolutely nothing to do about it. Many women have fallen victim of it in the past. And many of them died as a result of the punishment from the gods. God forbid. Eh? Papa, God forbid. Her case will be different. If he cannot die like that. After I was the cause of the entire episode. Don't tell me that. How did you cause it? 
Tell us, how did you cause it? I thought she ran mad after committing adultery. Tell us, how did you cause it? <sighs> Mama, she didn't do it intentionally. She caught me bed handed cheating in a hotel with another woman. And when she asked me, I, I refused to accept it. Instead, I beat her up, even when I knew she was saying the truth. Probably she did it because she saw me doing it. You see? You see what I've been complaining about? In as much as I wouldn't support what she did. But why will only the woman receive the punishment? Eh? That was exactly what your father was doing when we got married. And I would have done the same thing if not for this useless tradition. Your father's home was on daily basis. Mind your tongue. Woman, I said mind your tongue. Am I lying? See what your son inherited from you has cost now. Like father. Nonsense. Nonsense. Don't ever mind your mother. Like father, like son. Yes. That is her character sometimes. Don't mind her. Uh, but papa. Mama is right in her judgment. Eh? Yes. If there will be any punishment for adultery, then it should be even. And not the poor woman alone suffering is all alone. Listen, children. I am not the one that made the law. That is how I made it. All I'm saying is this. Something must be done to restore my wife's sanity. Period. <laughs> There's nothing anybody can do about it. Something must be done, though. Listen, I would rather advise you to forget about it and mind your life. Yes. Learn about your life. Then, if you want to marry an adulterous woman, marry from outside our village. Yes. Is that what he said? That is what I said. Is that what he said, Papa? Oh, yes. People will hear from me. Don't no, ever... No, 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 no. You will hear from me. Listen, don't ever try the ghost. Otherwise, you will fall victim of the gods. Then the gods will hear from me. All right. No problem. Go ahead and My son, the No, no, no. Nobody should call me back. Please take it easy. I won't take it easy. That's a That is what you cause. Hmm. I said the truth. You don't want him to respect the gods. Okay, um, mm -hmm. Ngozi, Obina. Obina, I, I, I think you, you guys should go back from here. I need to hurry before they return. Okay, sister. I will miss you. I don't know if Papa and Mama kiss me out of the house. I don't know too, but... I'll, I'll miss the both of you. I'll miss you. What can I do? This house is not just good for me now. But I just need to be away for some time before until things goes back to normal. Okay, sister. Just take care of yourself. Good brother for us. I'm telling you, I'm still expecting the phone. <laughs> of course, I will, I will tell him. Come here, sister. Sister, I, mean, I want to come with you. Uh uh. Obina, don't start. Don't worry, allow me to go first, okay? Maybe when I'm settled, you can come. Alright?
I just had to run to the village. Mama was insisting that I marry one of the Omata boys that were coming. Why Papa was of the opinion that I go back to Kenna's family? Omata. Omata boys. Those illiterate boys from the main market. <laughs> And Papa's option is even worse. Listen, you are not marrying any old man. In fact, I insist that you're staying back in the city with me now. Brother, they threaten to make serious trouble with Papa if I don't return or pay back the bride price. How much is this dowry we're talking about? How much is it? Okay, I will pay back the dowry. So that to keep those evil, old, wicked men away from you. But the time Papa gave me to, to even pay this dowry has not elapsed. So what's the problem? I don't know. Maybe, may, maybe you should call Papa now. I think I need to call him. Let me just sort this out. Well, you know what? I also need you to pick up the jam phone. Register. And then I'll also register you in one of these schools for lessons. I think that will help. What? <laughs> I hope I, I can still cope, Sha. Cope with what? The, the lesson. Am I sure you can cope with lesson? Uh -huh. Okay. Um, Ada, you have two options. First option, you go for lesson, you end up in the university. Second option, you marry one old man as a third wife. Hey! A 70 year old man who is actually digging his own grave. God forbid. Yeah. Keep doing this. Don't read. I'm in the kitchen. When you're ready, come. Your father around? Yes, sir. He is. Uh, let me go and call him. Um, who do I tell him is here? Tell him to for call him. Yes, sir. Papa! Papa! Ah. <laughs> Chief for call him. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> what police should do my house? Uh, I come in peace. Oh, am I forbidden from coming to your house? Not at all, I eh? am only overwhelmed by this unexpected but welcome visit. You're most welcome. Thank you. Um, let's sit down. It's hot inside. So, you are welcome once again. Madam. Good, good day, sir. Good afternoon, yeah. sir. Good day. How are you? I'm fine, sir. You're welcome. Actually, I'm just coming from your house. From my house? I met your husband. Who call is well? No problem. <laughs> it is well. Very soon you'll find out why I came. Um, just wait a moment. Take this. Buy yourself. Yes. Buy yourself my daughter, my daughter, come. You, come. Take this, buy yourself something. Thank you, sir. God bless you, sir. Bless you, too. God bless you, sir. Please, oh, thank you so much. Send my greetings to your family. Yes, sir. Hey. Bye, 
Thank you so much, sir. Bring it and let me hold it for now. Oh, right, 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 right. Okay. See, look at it. For us. This one that he gave us, this one. Only God knows how much he gave to your father. Mm. Let us hurry and see how much he gave him. It's true, man. And let us find out his mission first. Mm. Hey, God, oh, thank you so much. Oh. Hey. Shut up. Dance first. We bring you back in a pause of making it. We bring you back in a pause of making it. We bring you back in a pause of making it. We bring you back in a pause of making it. We bring you back in a pause of making it. We bring you back in a pause of making it. Open it, work and egg. You make walls of neck and egg. Does she make it? You make an egg. You make eh? No, no. No, no. No, no. Oh, no. No, no. This one, you are so excited. Has mana fallen from heaven? It's from our in law. In law? God has finally decided to send the Messiah to this family. Thank God. Eh? And who could that be? Chief O'Cooley's son is seeking our daughter's hand in marriage. Thomas hand. We will not break it. You make us unbreakable. We will not break it. You make us unbreakable. We will not break it. You make us unbreakable. We will not break it. You make us unbreakable. We will not break it. You will not break it. You make us unbreakable. Haja. We will not break it. You make us unbreakable. Who could not have been awake? He may pause and make a name. We leave you no world after. Sorry, I came late. I had to drop Angela off before coming. Since you said we needed some privacy. You're drinking heavy. What is it? Richard, my heart is heavy. You need to see my wife's condition. It's only match now. Did you see her? Where? Richard, you need to see my wife, Ify. Running around the village market. Jumping in the gutters. Swimming in the mud. Mad. Are you serious? I saw her in such a pitiable state. And I regretted ever marrying her in the first place because I put her in that condition. God. I know that God will never forgive me until I do something to remedy her situation. I truly understand how you feel. Okay, but what can you do about this? Absolutely nothing. I mean, you have to let it go. Put everything aside and move on with your life. The main thing is that you have learned your lesson. No. No, Richard. I'm not going to let it go. Rather, I would do anything within my powers to restore her sanity. <laughs> you must be kidding. Anything like what? You remember that girl was struck by the gods, and anything you would do would be against the gods of your land. To hell with the gods for all I care. If the gods were sensible enough, they would punish every perpetrator of adultery, and not the poor woman alone. That is what they call injustice. <sighs> Calm down. No, 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 don't tell me to calm down. You have to take it no, easy. No, no, don't tell me that. Calm down. Well, why I asked you to come and see me is this. I've already made up my mind to take her to a psychiatric hospital. So I summoned you for your assistance. I need your company. So tell me, you're a good friend of mine. Are you with me or not? Well, Chide, I won't be a part to any suicide mission, okay? I strongly advise you retrace your steps. 
else you will have yourself to blame. Very well then. Very well. I'm not surprised. It's okay. You will hear from me. Richard, you hear the story. As for me, I won't retrace my steps. You lily livered friend of mine. Now I know the kind of friends I keep. It's alright. I'm so sorry for your time. I still commend you. It's alright. You can leave me now. Uh, Bama! Sure. Please, more drinks. Uh, you, can go, you can go, no problem. No problem. Bama! More drinks, please. I don't care whether she comes back or not. All I want is the money so that I can pay back the bride price as the custom demands. If not, you'll find me in your house in the city. I'll come and look for her. It's no more your business. Just let the time my in-laws gave me expire and you'll see whether you'll not find me in your house. If you send me the money, whatever you do with your sister is no more my business. Just uh, Biameka, I don't know what you and your father are discussing. But I want your sister to come back home. Send her to the village. Let her come and choose from all these prospective suitors that besiege our house every day. Let her just come. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> The battery is now dead. That is what suits you. One, 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 you open no, 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 Where are you? I didn't mean to hurt you. Please come back. Life is meaninglessly meaningful with or without you. Come back. <laughs> Thank you. There's no problem with you. 
Pizza Brussels. Let's go because there's no time to understand it. Please. Thank you very much. Let's go. Of course I know his son. That's the more reason I don't want to marry him. <laughs> Choma, in as much as I always support your decisions, I will never support this way. Why don't you marry this boy? The boy is good looking, has a very good job from a respectable family. Mama, that boy is arrogant and irresponsible. I've had encounters with him. And trust me, he is not even an option amongst my suitors. I think something is wrong with your head. You must be possessed by an evil spirit. And I promise you, I am going to deliver you with my bare hands. With my bare hands! Choma, do you know that this is the tenth suitor you have rejected since this year? You don't even know that you are not rejecting any younger. At all! Look at your mess. They are your, your husband's school. So have two children, or three children. Even up to, up to five children. Okay. Yes. Ah. Choma, what is your problem? For crying out loud, I want you to marry that boy. Marry him and play your card very well. Choma. Mama, I thought we had already settled this before now. Settled what? I want to go to school. I want to achieve my dream. Even if anything has to stop me from doing so, definitely not that boy. May a mother seal that your mouth. Look at you. Can you see that? Eh? You see why I was against the idea of Chuka giving her an American money to go and buy jam forms. She's now boasting to us she wants to go to school. Eh? No, I bet Chuka did not do anything wrong. He was only trying to help. At least to restore peace to this family. Has he achieved that peace now? He has encouraged our daughter to challenge our decisions that are in her best interest. Let me tell you, Choma. You must marry Chifukoli's son. Period. Period in care of the... Achi unachi apa. Hawa achi mwakono. Achi unachi apa. Hawa achi mwakono. Choma. Choma, you know I always want the best for you. I want you to marry this boy and have a blissful marriage. Do you know that if you marry him, you'll be treated like a princess? Yes. Your father does not have money. Neither do I. But Mama, he has money to want to train Nana. Yes. You know I did not support the idea at the first time. But it is his money. There's no way you will tell him how to spend his money. I do not lose sight that Nana is his first son. The only son that he will take his name if he, your father is no more. But Mama Chuka promised to help me if I gain admission into school. What is your problem, Choma? Is he a boy? Is he a boss? Eh? Has Chuka finished uh, training his numerous sisters? Eh? You must be very careful. Very, very careful. Or you, you get prepared for war with your father. 
you people better prepare for war. Because even if I must marry, definitely not that boy. Not him. Father, that is the latest news now. It seems as if his father brought Papa and Mama over with his wealth. You need to see the way they were sounding. As if they've never seen money their entire life. I can understand. I can really understand. But I don't know, I don't really know what to say. Because Papa is a very difficult man. And the problem is that you don't just like that young man. I don't too. He is very arrogant and too full of himself. Brother, I will not marry that boy. Instead, I'll pick amongst my other suitors. I won't marry a boy that will not respect me simply because he's from a family that is wealthy. The choice doesn't really seem to be yours. I think I'll come over to talk to them before I travel back to the city. And please, it will be very good if you do that. I'm sure they'll listen to you like they did in the jam issue. Eh? Please. <laughs> Meanwhile, brother, do you know that the money you paid for us to attend the extramoral classes? Uh, you and Amaka? Uh, it is only Nana that is attending. Papa said Amaka and I will not attend. What do you mean? How are you supposed to write and pass the exams? Oh, ask me. Ask me. I've been trying. I just try to read at home on my own. I've been trying my best. I only feel for Amaka. But she's not finding it easy at all. Just try and help yourself, and Amaka. We will certainly work out something. Immediately, people pass the exams. Yeah, hey, brother. Thank you so much. Thank you. Uh -huh. What about your friend you came out with the other day? Oh, that boy. Uh, he has gone back to the city. He just came to know my village. Oh, that's nice. Uh, nice guy. <laughs> uh, he is. We are like brothers from different mothers. Let me walk you over before Papa begin to say Choma is not around. Let's go. Let's go. I will try my best. I really don't understand what you're doing in the village. I mean, there are better opportunities in the, in, the, in the city. You could just, you know, get a job, a real job, know what you're doing here, you know? You know? How many times have you fulfilled your promises? That's our cousin Chuka. And is that why you're keeping your face like this? Uh, I thought someone was poaching in my territory. No, 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 me. <laughs> and the guy also resides in the city. But he has been around for some time now. Maybe he's also searching for his mystery. You know now, this married thing, I'm not believe you now. Are you sure they are related? Mm -hmm. Because, I mean, you said he's looking for a wife. No, I'm sure of what I'm saying. <sighs> this one, you're sounding so jealous. Do not forget that other guys were on queue before you. So. Play your card very well because she's not someone you can win with materialism. Okay? Yeah. So see it as a competition and play your card very well. That's all. That girl is so difficult. You know? You know, hey, think about this. Why don't we be friends with, with her cousin, right? With her cousin. And then maybe we can get to her through him. What do you think? A good idea, right? Yeah, it's not a bad one, sir, but that guy, I don't understand that guy. I'm a cool state right now. But we too. Why your parents no one use their influence and make this thing easy for you? I mean, they're just making things difficult. Oh, uh, well, my dad has been to see them. But, but the last time I saw the girl, she snubbed me. <laughs> Seriously, she, she snubbed me. That sounds right. I'm getting tired. <laughs> Seriously, I'm, 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 I'm so tired right now. I just want to finish everything and get back to the city. Then pick one of these village girls and stop bothering us with your marriage with now. Do I look like someone that will marry a village girl? Then play your card well and stop stop complaining. You know go marry village girl, you know fit get that one. Make your parents use their influence. They know fit. Ah. But, but you don't say it too talk. You don't say it too talk. Wait, you come with the girl. You don't say it too talk. So tell me, Chuka, what do you do in the city? I'm an architect by profession. I design and build houses for people. Jobs do come once in a while. Hmm. And judging by your look, you're doing okay? <laughs> To God be the glory. Yeah, you know, I'm always glad when I see people from our community doing well. Thank you very much. I might be able to help you out with your job, though. You know, I know one or two people that could help you, you know, get jobs, building houses, or even estates, if you can manage that. Oh, that would be very nice. Hmm? Yeah, but thanks. Uh, but I hope he's not going to be on the politics. 
<laughs> oh, come on. I don't, I don't do things. I don't say things I can't do. Listen, uh, here's my car. Right. Mm -hmm. Maybe we can hook up in the city and then, you know, iron things out. Right. So, um, where are you going? Let me, I want to get somewhere. Man, you haven't finished your drink, your no, meat? No, 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 I'm okay. Hmm? I'm okay. Okay, uh, okay. Yeah. Uh, okay, now. You know what? Give me a call and, um, you know, we'll talk about things. Okay. All right. Oh boy, really I thought I spoke well today. What is bad? What do you mean by that? You, you mean I don't speak well and act well normally? Ha. Do you need a soothsayer to tell you that? But who would you? Why didn't you tell him also? Maybe he would have obliged as a result of your empty promises. You underrate me, you know that. You you think I just made empty promises? Ah, come out there. See as you just give him car like saying are you danger of all the houses within the beautiful city. Keep insulting me. Mm, seriously. Listen, the reason I did not say anything to him is because it's too early. I don't even have to say anything. Now we are friends. Okay? Now maybe somewhere along the line, the sister of the cousin, as you say, mm -hmm. will now mention to him mm -hmm. or, uh, you know, about my interest, mm -hmm. he will automatically become a middleman. <sighs> you are beginning to think very fast and responsibly. You know, if you keep insulting me, mm -hmm. you go try to go out. Me? Yes. Try, try come from here to my house? Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. Then in that case, you forget the girl. Send him out to the girl if you try that. Yeah, yeah. What are you feeling like? Born, what are you born, feeling born, like? Born. I just yeah. born. Listen, Abe, this Mpobi. Madam, have you been... Uh, bring more, bring more. No, now, Abe, this thing that he's eating, I'm not paying for it. You will pay for him. Or that she yeah, should bring more. Pay. Yes. Come collect your money now that he's still here. You know me now. He will pay for nah, it. He order. <laughs> if you don't collect your money from me. I told you. Don't collect your money from me. I can see that few people are preparing for the exam. <laughs> but I was trying. Though it's not easy reading at home, it would have been better if we had gone for the extramoral classes. You can still pass the exam without the extramoral classes. And uh, what about Nana? Yeah, that one. He went to let you know. It's not as if he's learning anything there. He only goes there to waste his time and play with those of his naughty friends. That Nana, he has a lot of trouble. Amaka! Amaka! Brother, it's true. That boy is just an empty brain. <laughs> now, now talk more. Uh -huh, I beg. Is Papa at home? Uh, Papa is inside. He sent for me. Hey, it must be this marriage issue. Brother, I have seen hell lately in this house. Chama, don't worry. Calm down, don't worry. Let me see him first. I will get back to you people, eh? For me, I've, I've said my own no. I can never marry from this village. I'm not going to tell them. Toga. I invited you here because I know you have love for my family. I know my children listen to you, especially the girls. I want to thank you for the money you gave Chioma and Amaka to buy jam forms. And for the further effort you made for their extramural classes, even though that one didn't work out for good reasons anyway. Thank you, Papa. It's always been a pleasure. I know you did all that. Because he want peace in my family. Even though it still did not work out. But Choma, what are you talking about? How do you mean, Papa? Ever since he gave my children money to buy jam farms, they have stopped going for any errand in this family. If you send them on an errand, they'll tell you they are preparing for exams. It's exams. not true. But Choma, it's not true. Stop forging lies against these innocent children. Were you not the person that stopped them from these extra moral stories that you paid for? Mwanya, if you intervene again, I deal with you. Don't interrupt me as I talk. Then say the truth and stop forging lies against this innocent children. After all, this is not why we invited you here in the first place. Mama, please, allow him to finish. Papa, please, I want you to understand that I never meant 
to cause any problem in this family. I am only trying to assist in my own little way. That was why I acknowledged your good intentions in the first place. Anyway, that's by the way. The reason why we invited you is to help us talk to your cousin Choma. Choma is trying to spit the sugar put in her mouth. See, why have you seen that? If anybody nah, hit the nail on itself, I have a lot to do at the backyard, please. Choka, warn your auntie. Warn her. Let me not lose my temper. In fact, if she's not careful, the anger I will start for Choma, I will burn to her if she's not careful. Mama, 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 allow, allow him to finish so that you can. Who invited you in the first place? Who told you to come here? Mama, Choma, be very careful with me. Anyway, Chuka, as I was saying before, this woman rudely and disrespectfully interrupted me. Something has to be done about this situation. Yeah, I went when he had my mother. But no part I woke him. I cheat when I cheat. I watch him for a bottle. Chuka, Chief Okoli's son decided to put smiles on our wrinkled faces. But Chuma is saying no to that. Chuma has proved obstinate. Your wife is declining this beautiful offer. That's our problem. Eh? My son, this is why we invited you here. To help us talk to Choma. We cannot miss this golden opportunity. Do you know that this man, Mr. Okoli, Chief Okoli, came here himself. When he left, everybody was happy except Choma. Please, we cannot miss this golden opportunity. Help us talk to her. The man oiled our hands. He even brought to me beautiful wines I can drink for my health. Why is she doing this to the family? Huh? Okay, Uncle, I've heard, all, I've heard all you have to say. I think I will talk to her and make her see reasons with you. But uh, I want you to remember something. Her happiness remains paramount in her marriage. We know all that. Please talk to her. Hey! Achi Ebu! Nachi Ebu, Achi Ebu! to trace the boy? Not at all. Mm? I have uh, gone as far as reporting to the police. But of what use is that? The idiot called me and even sent me a text telling me that I should not bother looking for him since, since he has traveled out of the country with my money. Sure. Huh? And that w when he settles down, he will pay me back. Can you, can you imagine the idiot? No. How, how could I have, have been so stupid to have sent him to go and withdraw that kind of money? Uh, uh, money I was given to supply goods. Now, I, I, I can't supply the goods. I can't refund the money to the people I'm supposed to supply the goods to. Just take it, what, do I, what do I do? How, how do I refund the money to the owner of the money? I, I, I can't even supply the goods. What, 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 do, I, what do I do? It's okay. Oh, Papa, you leave me alone now. What is he calling me for? I'll just break his phone. What are they calling me for? You should just leave me alone. What are they, what, what are they calling me for?
So after all we said, you refuse to take back your daughter to where she belongs. To the husband's house. No, actually, huh? this is beyond what you think. The truth is that uh, Adobe ran out of the house and mm -hmm. we have been trying all efforts to bring her back has proved abortive. And who do you expect to believe such <laughs> cock and bull story? I'm telling you the truth. There's no way I can lie. Eh? We are planning to go to the city to bring her back because we have discovered she ran to the city to stay with mm. my son who is staying there. Go and tell it to the best. Because we are no longer interested in your daughter. We have come back to collect our money and all expenses we made on her. It's not like that. Just give me hey. a little time. In fact, I will go to the city by myself and bring her back. Mm -hmm. Before you know it, this thing must have become a thing of the past. Mm -hmm. Please, give us back the bright price and all other expenses we spent on her. Ah, uh -huh. we are going to disgrace in your house so here now. Hey, Mbano. Hey, Mbano. Hey, Oh, in-laws. Please. Yeah. Please, you have to exercise a little patience with us. We're having some difficulties. Now that you know that we are, you are in loss. Huh? Anyway, this is not women's affair. And you are not concerned. Huh? Boys! Nine. Go inside and carry out everything in this house. Go inside! Go! 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 Pain and sorrow. We live in a life of fear and of shadow. We pay no price after things we don't know about. We die in pace and we're looking for a way out. Oh. My eyes they pain me from so much crying. Hoping for a better day 